Hey there friends, how you doing today? Welcome back to my review thing or other. Anyway, I'm here to do a short review of Batman v Superman because my friend and I, uh, Tim, ended up doing a very long review and it's about an hour and something minutes. Yeah, it's long. So here's my brief review about Batman vs. Superman. It was okay. That's it. I'm done. No, no, no. Um, in all seriousness, uh, the movie was fine. It was okay. Uh, I've heard quite a bit of different points of view. I mean, it's been a week since it's been out, and I've heard some of my friends talk about it, see what they thought, and uh, my general consensus is uh, if, if you have a, a big-time understanding of... Who these characters are, Batman and Superman, uh, and you have a, a set thought process as to how they should act and how, how they would act, like Lex Luthor um, and Wonder Woman and Doomsday and uh, j just that set thought process, you may not enjoy this as much as you think you would. Yet you, you might actually agree with a lot of the reviews going down to 30% review points. Um, myself, I kind of had those expectations, but at the same time, watching the whole movie as a, as a whole, I, I've got to say, I really liked it. it um, as a movie, th they portrayed the characters wrong, but that's about the only issue I have with the movie at all. Um, and if these, were, if these characters were characters I had no knowledge about, no background for, I'd be like, I want to know more about this character. I want to know why they're thinking it like this. I want to know what's going on through their, uh, their, through their minds. Um, what's their backstory? What's their story? Like there was a part in uh, where they, they showed a brief glimpse of a, a bat suit or a robin suit or something that obviously was attacked by the Joker. And uh, it's like, oh, wow, I kind of want to know what the story is behind that. Or uh, things like the bat branding. And I, sorry, there, there's spoilers in this review. Um, but, I mean, this has been talked about all over the place. If you haven't heard about the bat brand, then I uh, uh but yeah, it's it's just so much, so much that could have been touched upon, they didn't. And then there was things that they could have left out that I feel, it's, I feel that they could have actually um, saved for the next movie. Wonder Woman, they did great. Uh, everyone I've talked to wishes they did more of Wonder Woman. Uh, they... they would have expanded more upon Wonder Woman in this, um, because they 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 hit spot on. It was really good. Um, Superman they did a lot better in this one than they did in the last one. At the beginning, he was still kind of rocky, but towards the end, he actually felt like a Superman that you would know and love. Um, Lex Luthor. He wasn't Lex Luthor. I, I've got to tell you, and, and it, it, I don't think it has anything to do with the the actor's uh, position. Not at all. No, uh, I think it was just the the portrayal, the direction that um, they wanted to go with. And honestly, they they really could have gone with a, a different villain at that point. Then, if they were going to do Lex Luthor like this, it, it felt more like a Joker. I, I, I'm I'm sorry to say. Not really. I'm not really sorry to say this. If you guys are going to go in here, go into the movie expecting that Lex Luthor is going to be calm, calculating, ten step ahead, only one of those three things is pretty much what he is. And that's this ten steps ahead part. Just telling you. Just telling you. Um, so don't get disappointed by that. Uh, Batman... He's a little more off the rails, but I mean, okay, this is 
a, a whole setup to have Batman fight Superman and then do this big old comic plot that's been done way too soon. And if you watch the longer review, Tim and I end up actually going further into discussion about it. So I, I'm trying, I'm really trying to hard, I'm trying to think of not real big spoilers that were talked about in the long review that I, I shouldn't say here because I'm trying to make this as spoiler free as possible. Yet at the same time, I don't want you going into the theater uh, without the explanations or something. Yeah. So don't. So you know, out of a scale of one to ten, as I said in my long review, I'd give it a five out of ten. Would I recommend it? Yeah. I'd recommend you to go see the movie to make your own opinions about it because my dad and I saw this together. My dad loved the movie. He he thinks I'm crazy and everyone else that oh, uh, is really hating upon this movie is crazy for hating upon it. And I mean, I can see his point. The action scenes were phenomenal. I love those action scenes. They, they were great. Um, then you had the, uh, uh, the story that they led up to. I mean, I don't think they wasted anything. It was probably a little too jam-packed. I mean, th there was a lot of information that they had in there. Th there was a lot. But then, but then they, they kind of... I mean, okay, it was long, but it was a lot of information, and it felt like they rushed. So it was like a long rush. I, that's kind of hard to, for me to explain. They, they really could have made this into two movies uh, and, and not lost anything. And probably, probably they would have gained from it. I mean, they, they could have taken out some pieces of this movie, put it into another, and probably had the story of Batman versus Superman flourish a bit more. And yes, as according to the title, Dawn of Justice, this is the beginning of the Justice League. Um, so, yeah, it, it, that, that's really all I got to say about this movie. Um, and it's an okay movie. If you guys want to see it, please, uh, please check it out. And for those of you that haven't seen it or would like to see this hour-long review that my uh, discussion it's kind of a review discussion thing that my friend and i went into it it's right over here it's over here you can check it out click right here it's good to go and, and i'll probably have the the card link in throughout the whole video right over here or here so you'll probably see that right here so yeah oh and that, that's really about all i, I gotta say about that have fun Alright, so one thing I think I forgot to mention was that if you have any thoughts, any thoughts at all about how good, how bad, uh, how in between the movie was, tell us down below. I mean, I'm very interested in hearing what your opinions of the movie were. Um, whether you absolutely loved it, if you absolutely hated it, um, I'm interested. I, I want to know. And it would be a great discussion, so just comment down below and we'll see what uh what everyone has to say about it until next time i'll see you later and remember to always have fun